Now, sometimes we have a prefix operator like the integer division function, um, uh, which, so let's use that. So what's 10 divided by three? Well, it's three. Um, but maybe we don't want to use it that way because that's confusing. So what we can do is we can take a prefix function and if we surround it by back ticks, then we can stick it in the middle as an infix operator. Um, while we're on this particular function, the integer division, um, there's a different operator for floating point division. So that's the conventional slash. So if I say 10 slash three, what's actually gonna happen there is those two numbers are gonna get converted to floats and then they'll divide. Um, uh, and we cannot, let's see if we can, can we take a floating point 10 and provide and perform the integer division on it? Let's see what's gonna happen there. And so actually what happened there is that we cannot say 10 dot. That's no good. We have to say 10.0 to get the floating point 10. So let's try it again. The floating point 10 using the integer divide and the floating point three. What do we think is going to happen? So it looks like we could not coerce them down to integers in order to produce, in order to perform the division.